Hello, my name is Joanna and in this video I want to show how we can build bar chart for our web applications using AI. Let's start. I will use ChatGPT version 4 with additional feature code interpreter. I am going to pass my employees Excel file and additional requirements also I write here. And I have Next.js application where I prepare employee page where I'm going to put my future bar charts and placeholder for this bar charts. So I've passed it and we need to wait for generation. So result generation was finished and firstly AI asked me what library I prefer. And uh, there were two options, charges and DCGS, so I just choose uh, DCGS because I didn't uh, experience a visit before and I wanted to build a bar chart from zero. And also I have additionally asked to put all data in one uh, in my page, as firstly it's not put in one place. And uh, now we have results, so we can just copy and try what we have. So copy bar chart. So we need to import it. And let's copy data and bar chart here. Let's check what we have. Now we have this bar chart. And also I want to add one more bar chart by chart for number of employees by department. Just uh, pass this additional requirement for by bar chart. And let's see what we will have also need to wait some okay great now i have got for another bar chart let's copy the code and check also new data And let's import also this component. Okay, I will save it and oh, let's see. Great! Now we have two bar charts, different types of it, and you can see how it can be fast and easier to build it. Also, we can change something in computer, create more. Uh, different settings and um, other colors but for first setup it really great and a little extra if you don't have access to this feature for code interpretation you can just um, simply copy your excel table with data and uh, pass it uh, to AI as it is and ask just to convert this to JSON and uh, generate a um, diagram based on this. And also we can ask to write bar chart based on parameters, what we will get and properties in case we don't have such table and we will go and to get um, this data from backend. So that's it from my side. Thank you for your attention.